Do you make a lot of errors, Dinkin? I did. Not anymore. <laughs> With the lift push concept, you can eliminate many of these Dinkin mistakes. Guys and ladies, please subscribe, leave your comments, and have a good day. We're going back to college here at the Pickleball Pirate. We're in Dinkin 101. You're a freshman in college again. What is a, <laughs> what is a lift dink and what is a push dink? Can you spot them in this point? That was one. And I'm gonna go back and put it in slow motion. But this is a really good point. Nick is an orange. He is a very good push dinker. And Keith is a very good lift dinker in the top right hand corner in gray who just had the Ernie. Nick hits a push dink, low trajectory, deeper in the court, usually cross court, and it puts the opponent on the defensive. Keith does a smart thing. He hits a lift dink, shallow in the kitchen, so it is unattackable. And here's the second push dink. Nick hits it. It is deep in the court, low trajectory. Keith hits higher trajectory, shallower in the kitchen, so it is unattackable. Here is Ben Johns. Can you spot the push dinks? That's three push dinks and there's three lift dinks in this point. If you know Ben Johns, he's in the near left hand corner. He is such an offensive dinker. So here's the first push dink. Now this is not cross court, but he's good enough to do this. Now Deco Bar steps back with a right leg and lifts the dink shallower in the court. Ben Johns hits another push dink and all Adam Stone can do is hit a lift dink. It's going to be shallower in the court so it is unattackable. Ben Johns yet hits another push dink to put Adam Stone on the defensive. Adam Stone does not panic. He hits another lift dink. Have patience. Deco Bar and Adam Stone won this point. Here is an example of a forehand lift dink. And racquetball players do this really well. If you look, step back with a right leg and lift it over the net and get back in the Dinkin War. Now, I would prefer to keep that left foot right at the kitchen line and just move that right leg back. By understanding this simple concept, you're going to do better at Dinkin Wars and you're going to win more games. Guys and ladies, I have a ton more segments coming. This is just the tip of the iceberg on the lift push concept. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave your comments and have a good day. <laughs>